Welcome or welcome back on C Square. In this video clip, we're going to talk about reflection over x axis and y equals a. In other words, reflecting over a horizontal line. And the first example here, uh, it's uh, talking about reflecting the segment AB with the given coordinates. Uh, over the x-axis and let's take the first point 4 and 7 which you see it's uh, somewhere here And we need to reflect it over the x-axis. Let me simply count how far away you are from the x-axis. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, obviously. 1, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. This will be point A prime if this is A. And here we can come over rule, obviously. So 4, 7, that was the original point, becomes 4 and negative 7. So the rule reflecting over the x axis is xy becomes x and negative y. And this is the rule we're going to use for reflecting B. So let's do that for A also. 4 and 7 becomes A prime, which is 4 and negative 7. For B, the same story. 2 and negative 3 becomes, again, X stay the same to the Y switch. It was negative here. Negative 3 becomes positive 3. Now let's take a look to this one, reflect a segment AB, the same segment AB, over Y equals negative 2. So as you notice, the y equals negative 2 is the horizontal line that uh, goes two units down from the x-axis. This, in this case, the reflection will be done just by counting. Point A is 9 units away from the rhino reflection. Uh, the blue line, so I'm going to go 9 units down. And in fact, you notice that I cannot even fit that in the screen. But uh, let's use a little bit of uh, uh, addition and subtraction here. If you uh, remember, this is y equals negative 2, we go 9 units down from that, so this guy here needs to be negative 11 for y and obviously 4. So, yeah, under this transformation, under this reflection, the point A, 4 and 7, becomes A prime, the same coordinate, the y coordinate, is negative 11. Go ahead and do B and let's see what we you get for B.
if you end up with the result uh, b prime equals to b the coordinate b prime uh, 2 and negative 1 then you did a very good job and you can see that on the screen also b is one unit away one unit down from the line of reflection b prime is going to be also one unit away but now up from the line of reflection so 2 and negative 1 If you enjoyed this video clip, don't forget to click the like button and come back for more uh, video clips on C-square.